and in suspension for 58 days. In compliance with state and federal regulations, all testing candidates in the amateur relaxation center must be revived periodically for a mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look up at the ceiling. Good. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look down at the floor. Good. This completes the gymnastic portion of your mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. <coughs> there is a frame painting on the wall. Please go stand in front of it. Oh, this. Let's go. Oh. This yeah, is I just bought a little table you this game. A I've a seen a lot of this Stare game. At the art. Stare at what? Oh. You should now feel mentally reinvigorated. If you suspect TV. staring at art has not provided the required intellectual sustenance, reflect briefly on this classical music. Yeah. Good. Now please return to your bed. Good morning. You have been in suspension for nine, 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 nine. This oh my. Anyone in there? Wheatley? Ah, ah, God, God. You look um, good. Looking good, actually. Are you okay? Are, are you? Well, don't answer that. I'm absolutely sure you're fine. There's plenty of time for you to recover. Just take it. Please seat. prepare for emergency evacuation. Stay calm. Stay, stay calm. Prepare. It's all the same. Prepare. It's all fine. <laughs> all right. Don't move. I'm gonna get us out of here. Oh, you might want to hang on to something. Word of advice, up to you. Wait, what's going on? Down there? Can you hear me? What? What's going on? Hello? Ah, there you are. Most test subjects do experience some uh, cognitive deterioration after a few months in suspension. Now, you've been under for quite a lot longer, and it's not out of the question that you might have a very minor case of serious brain damage. But don't be alarmed, all right? Uh, although, if you, do, if you do feel alarmed, try to hold on to that feeling, because that is the proper reaction to being told that you've got brain damage. Do you understand what I'm saying at all? Does any of this make any sense? Just tell me. Just say yes. Okay, what you're doing there is jumping. Uh, you, just, you just jumped. But never mind. Say apple. Apple. Okay, you know what? That's close enough. Just hold tight. All reactor core safeguards are now non-functional. Please prepare for reactor core meltdown. Okay, look, I wasn't going to mention this to you, but I'm in pretty hot water here. How are you doing down there? You still holding on? The reserve power ran out, so of course the whole relaxation center stops waking up the bloody test subjects. Hold on. This is a bit tricky. And of course, nobody tells me anything. No, why should you tell me anything? Why should I be kept informed? You know, about the life functions of the 10,000 bloody test subjects I'm supposed to be in charge of. Why? It's close. Can you see? Am I going to make it through? But I love space. And <clears throat> just, just got to get through here. Go up. I, I just got to concentrate. Whose fault do you think it's going to be when the management comes down here and finds 10,000 flipping vegetables? Oh, we're going to the left now. No, I want, I want to get on the bed. No. Okay. All right. If anyone asks, and no one's going to ask, don't worry. But if anyone asks, tell them as far as you know. The last time you checked, everyone looked pretty much alive. All right. Not dead. Okay. Almost there. On the other side of that wall is one of the old testing tracks. There's a piece of equipment in there that we're going to need to get out of here. I, I think this is a docking station. Get ready. Good news. That is not a docking station. So there's one mystery solved. Uh, I'm going to attempt a manual override on this wall. Could get a bit technical. Hold on. Break the wall. Remember, you're looking for a gun that makes holes, not bullet holes. But don't worry, you'll figure it out. Seriously, do hold on this time. There we go. Good luck. Hello, and again.
again welcome to the Aperture Science Enrichment Center. We are currently experiencing technical difficulties due to circumstances of potentially apocalyptic significance beyond our control. However, thanks to emergency testing protocols, testing can continue. These pre-recorded messages will provide instructional and motivational support so that science can still be done, even in the event of environmental, social, economic, or structural collapse. The portal will open and emergency testing will begin in three, oh, oh, oh. two, one. happening twice are very slim. <coughs> if you feel liquid running down your neck, relax, lie on your back, and apply immediate pressure to your temples. What? You are simply experiencing a rare reaction in which the material emancipation grill may have emancipated the ear tubes inside your head. Because of the technical difficulties we are currently experiencing, your test environment is unsupervised. Before re-entering a relaxation vault at the conclusion of testing, please take a moment to write down the results of your test. An Aperture Science Reintegration Associate will remind you for an interview when society has been rebuilt. Yeah, I don't think society is being rebuilt. I think everyone's dead. If the Earth is currently governed by a manner of animal king, sending a cloud, or other governing body that either oh. to or is incapable <laughs> that's a, that's of... That's a big animal change. turret. That, that's not an animal king. <clears throat> yeah, yeah! Hey, you made it! Wait, wait. Wait, can I turn on subtitles? Yeah. It's on that podium over there. I can't see it though. Maybe it fell off. Do you want to go? Hello? Can you see the portal gun? The portal gun. Whoa. Is that me? That looks like... Uh, is that GLaDOS? That's definitely me. Some emergency testing may require prolonged interaction with lethal military androids. Rest assured that all lethal military androids have been taught to read and provided with one copy of the laws of robotics. To share. Good. If you feel that a lethal military android has not respected your rights as detailed in the laws of robotics, please note it on your self-reporting form. A future Aperture Science Entitlement Associate will initiate the appropriate grievance filing paperwork. I love the Portal series. This next test is very dangerous. 
To help you remain tranquil in the face of almost certain death, smooth jazz will be deployed in three, two, one. Great work. Because this message is pre-recorded, any observations related to your performance are speculation on our part. Please disregard any undeserved compliments. Center is currently being bombarded with fireballs, meteorites, or other objects from space. Please avoid unsheltered testing areas wherever a lack of shelter from space debris does not appear to be a deliberate part of the test. I'm stuck in here. Oh. Wee. The Enrichment Center reminds you that although circumstances may appear bleak, you are not alone. All Aperture Science personality constructs will remain functional in apocalyptic, low-power environments of as few as 1.1 volts. test applies the principles of momentum to movements through portals. If the laws of physics no longer apply in the future, God help you. <laughs> Wee! Oh, let's see what I gotta do here. Woo! Where do I get a cube from? Is there a cube somewhere? No, that's where I came from. Oh, I see the cube now. discovered this facility amid the ruins of civilization. Welcome. And remember, testing is the future. And the future starts with you. Wee! Up 
there maybe? No, wait, I see. This far, future starter. That said, if you are simple minded, old, or irradiated in such a way that the future should not start with you, please return to your primitive tribe and send back <laughs> someone better qualified for testing. <laughs> to ensure that sufficient power remains for core testing protocols, all safety devices have been disabled. The Enrichment Center respects your right to have questions or concerns about this policy. find a portal gun oh the, do you know what it just goes to show people with brain damage are the real heroes in the end aren't they at the end of the day brave okay listen let me lay something on you here it's pretty heavy they told me never never ever to disengage myself from my management rail or i would die but we're out of options here so get ready to catch me all right on the off chance that i'm not dead the moment I pop off this thing. On three. Ready? One. Two. Three! That's high. It's w it's too high, isn't it, really, that? All right, going really? on three just gives you too much time to think about it. Let's uh, go on one this time. Okay, ready? One. Catch me, catch me, catch me, catch me! Ow! I am not dead. I'm not dead! <laughs> Plug me into that stick on the wall over there, yeah? And I'll show you something. Where? I'm impressed Where? by this. Um, yeah, I can't do it if you're watching. Seriously, I'm not, I'm not joking. Could you just turn around for a second? I can't, I can't do it if you're watching. <laughs> All right, you can turn around now. Bam! Secret panel. Not open while your back was turned. Pick me up. Let's hand off we go. Look at this. No rail to tell us where to go. Oh, this is brilliant. We can go wherever we want. <coughs> Hold on, though. where are we going? Seriously. Hang on, let me just get my bearings. Um, just follow the rail, actually. Oh, no. Yes, hello. No, we're not stopping. Don't make eye contact, whatever you do. No, thanks. We're good. Appreciate it. Keep moving, keep moving. speed on something right now in order to escape we're gonna have to go through her chamber and she will probably kill us if if she's um, awake who oh glados okay i'm gonna lay my cards on the table i don't want to do it i don't want to go in there don't don't go in there don't, she, she's off she's off don't panic over she's off all fine on we go there she is glados what happened to you was, honestly like a proper maniac do you know who ended up purging and ended up taking her down in the end you're not going to believe this. A human. I know. I know. I wouldn't have believed either. Apparently this human escaped and uh, nobody's seen him since. Then there was a sort of long chunk of time where um, absolutely nothing happened. And then there's us escaping now. So um, that's pretty much the whole story. That's speed. Don't where do die. I go? I, oh, I have to walk through this. Okay, down these stairs. Jump! This, actually, look at it. That is ah! oh, still held. Still being held. You did, that's a great job. You've applied the grit. We're all fine. Ah! I just sorry. I just looked down. I do not recommend it. Ah! I've just done it again. This is the main breaker room. Look for a switch that says escape pod. All right. Don't touch anything else. Not interested in anything else. Don't touch anything else. Don't, don't even look at anything else. 
just well, obviously you've got to look at everything else to, to find the escape pod. But as soon as you look at something, it doesn't say escape pod. Look at something else. Look at the next thing. All right, but don't touch anything escape else. Or look at, or look at other things, but don't. You understand? How much was get all the way Can up there? there? I can't see it anywhere. Uh, tell you what. Oh, I can't leave. And I'll turn the lights on. Let there be light. That's uh, God. He's quoting God. Uh, what? Wait, what? Ominous. But probably fine, as long as it doesn't start, you know, moving up. Um... No. Escape pod, escape pod. What's going on? What? Wheatley! Okay. Wheatley, what have you done? Oh, no, Wheatley! Stop! No, it makes it go faster. Uh-oh. Power up initiated. Um, okay, um... Right, <laughs> Wheatley? GLaDOS is waking up. Wheatley! Oh, there's a, there's a password. Okay, it's fine. I'll just... I'll just... Uh, Wheatley, <laughs> behind you! Well, we're screwed. Well, GLaDOS is waking up, so we're completely screwed. Wheatley! Oh, it's you. You know her? It's been a long time. How have you been? I've been really busy. You know, after you murdered me. You did what? Uh. Oh no! No, 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 no! Oh no, 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 no! Yeah. Okay, look, we both said a lot of things that you're going to regret. But I think we can put our differences behind us. For science, you monster. <laughs> Seriously, we, we, of course you had to wake I up GLaDOS. But since you went to all the trouble of waking me up, you must really, really love to test. I love it too. There's just one small thing we need to take care of first. should be around here somewhere. Once you find it, we can start testing, just like old time. Here we are, the incinerator room. Be careful not to trip over any parts of me that didn't get completely burned when you threw them down here. The dual portal device should be around here somewhere. Once you find it, we can no! test it, just like old time. Ah. There it is. Hold on. There. Good. You have the dual portal device. There should be a way back to the testing area up ahead. Once testing starts, I'm required by protocol to keep interaction with you to a minimum. Luckily, we haven't started testing yet. This will be our only chance to talk. Here, let me get that for you. Do you know the biggest lesson I learned from what you did? I discovered I have a sort of black box quick save feature. In the event of a catastrophic failure, the last two minutes of my life are preserved for analysis. I was able, well, forced really, to relive you killing me again and again, forever. You know, if you've done that to somebody else, they might devote their existence to exacting revenge. Luckily, I'm a bigger person than that. I'm happy to put this all behind us and get back to work. After all, we've got a lot to do, and only 60 more years to do. More or less. I don't have the actuarial tables in front of me. But the important thing is you are back with me. And now I'm on to all your little tricks. So there's nothing to stop us from testing. 
for the rest of your life. After that, who knows? I might take up a hobby. Reanimating the dead, maybe. So wait, was my first portal gun just a single portal gun? Sorry about the mess. I've really let the place go since you killed me. By the way, thanks for that. Sarcasm self-test complete. Oh good, that's back online. I'll start getting everything else working while you perform this first simple test, which involves deadly lasers and how test subjects react when locked in a room with deadly lasers. Not bad. I forgot how good you are at this. You should pace yourself, though. We have a lot of tests to do. <coughs> this next test involves discouragement redirection cubes. I just finished building them before you had your, well, episode. So now we'll both get to see how they work. There should be one in the corner. Wee wee. Here come the test results. You are a horrible person. That's what it says. A horrible person. We weren't even testing for that. Did you still playing that game? Yeah. Don't let that horrible person thing discourage you. It's just a data point. If it makes you feel any better. Science has now validated your birth mother's decision to abandon you on wait, a doorstep. that do oh wait open the door what why wasn't why isn't the door open now oh Not on the test. Most people emerge from suspension terribly undernourished. I want to congratulate you on beating the odds and somehow managing to pack on a few pounds. <coughs> One moment. 
navigating these test chambers faster than I can build them. So feel free to slow down and do whatever it is you do when you're not destroying this facility. You are listening to me, but for the record, you don't have to go that slowly. over to the elevator and we'll continue the testing. This next test involves the Aperture Science Aerial Faith Plate. It was part of an initiative to investigate how well test subjects could solve problems when they were catapulted into space. Results were highly informative. They could not. Good luck. Here's an interesting fact. You're not breathing real air. It's too expensive to pump this far down. We just take carbon dioxide out of a room, freshen it up a little, and pump it back in. So you'll be breathing the same room full of air for the rest of your life. I thought that was interesting. See what the next test is. Oh, advanced aerial faith place. Well, have fun soaring through the air without a care in the world. I have to go to the wing that was made entirely of glass and pick up 15 acres of broken glass by myself. still cleaning out the test chambers, so sometimes there's still trash in them, standing around, smelling and being useless. Try to avoid the garbage hurtling towards you. What the...
remember them before when I was talking about smelly garbage standing around being useless? That was a metaphor. I was actually talking about you. And I'm sorry. You didn't react at the time, so I was worried it sailed right over your head. Which would have made this apology seem insane. That's why I had to call you garbage a second time just now. Did you know that people with guilty consciences are more easily startled by loud noises? I'm sorry. I don't know why that went off. Anyway, just an interesting science fact. Ooh. Oh, did I accidentally fizzle that before you could complete the test? I'm sorry. Go ahead and grab another one. Er. Oh, no. I fizzled that one too. <laughs> Oh well, we have warehouses full of the things. Absolutely worthless. I'm happy to get rid of them. Every test chamber is equipped with an emancipation grill at its exit, so that test subjects cannot smuggle test objects out of the test area. This one is broken. Don't take anything with you. <laughs> I'm taking the, cu the cube. Good. That will... Wait, there's a second companion cube. <laughs> Wait, that is a second a separate companion cube, right? take something with me, but I can't in this one. Yippee! Unless, is there a way to grab it from up here? No, I can't. Wait. Oh! I see. Mmm. -hmm.
I think that one was about to say, I love you. They are sentient, of course. We just have a lot of them. Next test involves emancipation grills. Remember, I told you about them in the last test area that did not have one. Oh no, the turbines again. I have to go. Wait, this next test does require some explanation. Let me give you the fast version. There, if you have any questions, just remember what I said in slow motion. Test on your own recognizance. I'll be right back. I'm playing Portal 2 right now. I literally bought it today. Portal 2. It's a game I've wanted for a while. trying to do here. Try 
I was just lying there. You thought I was mm. This plate must not be calibrated to someone of your generousness. I'll add a few zeros to the maximum weight. You look great, by the way. Very healthy. Try it now. Where? Right? Couldn't believe it either. You seem to have defeated its load-bearing capacity. Well done. I'll just lower the ceiling.